Welcome to the project demonstration of solar power multipurpose agribots. So here uh, it has the features like live video transmission with the help of Pi camera and also uh, we can implement that to the leaf disease detection by using the Raspberry Pi 0 to double you and we have coded that in Python language in OpenCV and Linux OS. And the next controlling purpose we are going to control the robot wave movements in four directions forward, backward, left, right and uh, seed sowing with the help of this seed drop mechanism by using the DC motor and this is for the plowing and this is for the water spraying. So here the whole system getting power supply from the two sources of batteries one is 12 volt 2 amps we are using and this is a battery power supply for the robot movement and water spraying and seed sowing. The next battery is for the raspberry pi power supply. So here we can see that this black color is the 12 volt 2 amp battery pack and the next power bank we are using of 5 volts power bank so this is a power bank so right and in order to provide the uninterrupted power source to the working model so we are using another extra battery of 10,000 mAh power bank so from this we are going to provide that so these two batteries rechargeable in both ways so if you want to charge this battery we need to connect the B type cable to this as shown in the B type slot so there is a light indication on this one which will show the status of battery charging when it is continuously on so it's indication of battery is fully charged till that we should keep this under charging so based on the charger power it will take time so high power charger so it will be charged in less time low power it will take the more time coming to the this battery charging to the solar panel so here we can see this there we can see the TRS over here there you can see TRS so T for transformer and S for the solar panel we need to connect the S while we're demonstrating under the sunlight and when there is no sunlight if you want to charge a battery then connect the T at this TRS slots and now on the power supply to this transformer so the transformer will charge a battery as you can see the red LED indication on this charger so it will take around uh, 8 hours to be fully charged so till that time we should keep on charging the battery so on successfully battery timing charging completes keep the wire safely and now coming to the circuit explanation so here you can see these two relays two relays are used to control the water motor from this tanker which we attached and seed sowing motor and the next L293D motor driver here we place the L293D motor driver this is the L293D motor driver so which is used to control the robot vehicle movement in four directions and the whole system getting input from this Raspberry Pi 0 to W so before demonstration uh, on the hotspot in your phone so change the hotspot name to project so right go to hotspot settings and uh, change the hotspot name to configure that to PRO JECT 5618 without any space without any capital letter and password should be 129 and band should be 2.4 gigahertz now on the odd spots okay right and now again give the power supply to the power bank right from the power bank to the raspberry pi now it is on and there is one more switch to one end of the robot uh, power supply to the l 293 d for robot movement so now we can see that once the booting was successfully done we can see one device will be connected on your phone my raspberry pi is connected so when you click on that it will show you the ip address over here so if some mobile phones doesn't show this ip address then install the network analyzer application and go to scan and do land scan so it will show the scan option so click on that then you will get the IP address of our Raspberry Pi copy that IP address and paste in Google Chrome with port number enter the port number also so right we need to enter in this manner right so 192.168.253.121 colon 5000 that's very important so after that right now we can see the visuals directly so let me control on floor directly right let us see that so forward moment stop backward stop right side left side 
okay and this one for seat mechanism on you can see that the speed mechanism got switched on and off purpose and this one is for the water on and water off